Former President Bill Clinton is still at UC Irvine Medical Center tonight, recovering from an infection, a UTI. It is not the first health scare he's had in recent years, but the hospital tells us he is on the mend. NBC4's Robert Kovacic joins us live at the Med Center right now with more on his condition. Robert. Colleen, and it appears at this late hour that the former First Lady and the former Secretary of State will be spending the night here at the hospital. Those cars right there are part of her security detail, and this could be the last night former President Clinton remains here in Orange County before heading home to New York. Night four inside UC Irvine Medical Center for former President Bill Clinton. Not to worry about number 42, according to 46, President Biden spoke with him on the phone. Get a hold of him. He's doing fine. He really is. A spokesperson for Mr. Clinton confirms he's on the mend and in good spirits. Mrs. Clinton, seen arriving this morning, has been by his side. The two in Orange County this week for a Clinton Foundation event, but when he reportedly felt fatigued, he was admitted Tuesday night. This has nothing to do with COVID. A source telling NBC News he was diagnosed with a urological infection that spread to his bloodstream. And though said to be responding well to antibiotics, this is yet another health scare for the former president. The 75-year-old with a family history of heart disease has had two major heart operations in the past. In 2004, a quadruple coronary bypass. In 2010, he received two stents in a blocked coronary artery. Also in 2010, Mr. Clinton was on the Today Show talking about the impact his bypass surgery has had on his life. How do you balance everything? Well, sometimes I don't. It's a constant struggle, you know, even at my age. When I had my my serious surgery five years ago, almost six years ago now, I realized that I've been given like a new lease on life. William Jefferson Clinton said to be, quote, incredibly grateful to the doctors, nurses, and staff here at UC Irvine Medical Center. But his spokesperson, Colleen, says the former president is just annoyed that he has to be in the hospital. That could change as early as tomorrow. Live tonight here in Orange, I'm Robert Kovacic. Let's go back to you.